If you need to go 12 and 0, complete domination, Evo cards, and other grinding services, go contact Rose NBA on Twitter. Link for that will be in the description. Yo, what's going on, guys? Witness 2K back on NBA 2K21, my team. In this video, we have a pack opening of the playoff records packs right here. There is a pullable diamond, Alan Iverson and Mark Eaton. Plus, there's an Amethyst, uh, Dirk Nowinski, and a couple of Ruby cards, including an MJ as well. So, we're going to go ahead and open up some of these packs. Maybe we can get lucky. The collection reward is a Diamond Derek Fisher, which is a pretty sweet card. I mean, I do like Derek Fisher personally. I think he's a legend. But um, there's also the Pink Diamond Dr. J as well. So, there's a Pink Diamond Dr. J. If you lock in all sets of these Tuesday promos like this one and the underdog set we got last last uh, last week. If you did all of those ones, I think there's five totals, you lock in all those sets, you get a free pink diamond Dr. J if you lock in all those sets. So that's a pretty sweet pickup and there's new spotlight challenges as well. And if you've been keeping up to date with those, if you've done all of those, you will get a, a free diamond Bill Russell as well. So couple of free cards up for grabs today if you have locked in this set. Obviously, I say free pink diamond Dr. J, but yes, obviously, you have to uh, get all the other cards in the other sets first, which obviously can cost some people money. Maybe you do it. Some people definitely can do it. No money spent. You know, it's not impossible, but obviously, it obviously makes it easier if you do spend money, but... If you get all those sets done, you do get a free Pink Diamond Dr. J. And if you've been grinding those spotlight challenges, again, there is a free Diamond Bill Russell up for grabs as well. And that is actually kind of free. I mean, there are some requirements for those challenges. And we see a Diamond Pull right here, guys, pretty early as well. So definitely really stoked about that for sure. We get a Diamond Pull. I really hope this is Alan Iverson, because if so, that is a huge dub. There's Alan Iverson and I can't even remember who the other one is. Western Conference, so it's not going to be Alan Iverson. Who is it? Mark Eden, of course. Couldn't remember, but we do get a diamond pull right there, which is sweet. Hopefully, we do see Alan Iverson in this pack opening as well, but I'm definitely happy to see a diamond pull nice and early, like seeing that Mark Eden pull right there. But um, yeah, let's keep, we're going to keep going. We still got a lot of packs that I'm going to go through and open. Um, unless I pull like Alan Iverson soon, there's no real point for me to continue. But yeah, we'll see. We get a diamond in this pack though. And we get a diamond pull. Not too many more packs after. I don't know if that made sense right there. We get another diamond pull, which is a huge freaking dub, man. This is crazy. Pack like really going nice for us right now. Please be Alan Iverson this time, though. We got Mark. Give me AI. Let's go. That's Alan Iverson right there. Literally pulling everyone right now. All we really need is Dirk. I don't... Dirk and maybe MJ, but we get AI and we get Mark Eden. That is a huge dub, so make sure you like this video and subscribe to the channel for pack. Like, we pull both the diamonds, so... I mean, there's not really a reason for me to continue. You know, I... I'll open up like three more singles just to see if we can get another diamond pull because I mean packs are actually treating this kind of nice which I mean I'm happy with for a change man it ain't it ain't common that I'm getting some uh, good pack luck but yeah I mean I'm kind I'm not gonna lie I am also kind of happy with NBA 2K21 uh, their pack luck I, I think it is better than NBA 2K20 I think I think we get a Ruby, uh, it's not MJ, it's going to be Robert Parrish again. I, I don't know if I've got MJ, honestly, I honestly don't. I haven't been paying attention that much. All I want to see, probably should not have quick sold that, but all I'm trying to see is uh, Diamond Glows now, and we'll have to get two of them. Both of the cards, AI and Mark, so yeah, that's a dub. Let's go ahead and open up one more pack before we check out the stats of those new Diamond cards. Can we get a third Diamond pull? We cannot, but yo, I'm happy with that. So here is Alan Iverson right here, 93 overall diamond, can play shooting guard and point guard, uh, 95 offense, 86 on defense, 6 foot tall, 95 driving a layup, he's got a 92 draw foul and shot close, 3 point shots only a 75, 
no sorry, mid range is only a 75, three point shot is an 83, free throw 86, driving down 80, ball handling and passing 95, pass accuracy 89. He's got an 82 in the steel, 80 perimeter defense, 94 in the speeds. His upgradable badges, he can, you can upgrade Brentless Finisher to, to a Hall of Fame contact finisher. Apparently, you can't do range extender, which so He doesn't have range extender. Uh, maybe they've updated it. You can do deep faith, but you cannot upgrade range extender, which really does suck, but... He's got ankle breaker, giant slayers, through finisher, tight handles. Yeah, we saw these gold badges right here. He looks solid, man. I mean, obviously he's small, but I think small point guards aren't going to be that bad this year. And we've got the Mark Eaton card right here as well. He's a 92 overall, not 93 overall diamond. Uh, he's humongous at 7 foot 4, 84 offense, 94 defense. He's got inside work, 88 post hook. He's got an 85 draw foul, shot close 89, 90 standing dunk, uh, ball handling and passing, obviously not that good, 97 block, 97 perimeter defense, 90 offensive rebounding, 94 defensive, so just the fact that he is 7 foot 4, like, he's going to be very hard to score on, he has 4 Hall of Fame badges, rim protector, box, defensive leader, and post move lockdown, plus 12 goal badges, so not a ton of badges, but... I mean, again, his height, just same same as like a card like Yao Ming or, or like Minute Bowl or something, that height is so cheesy in 2K. But that is going to wrap up this dub of a pack opening, guys. We got both diamonds right there, which is sweet. And it only took us about 150k MT, so huge profit, I think. If I sell those cards ASAP, you know, we can get some good coin for them. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you drop it a like. And of course, subscribe to the channel if you have not already. And I'll catch you guys on the next upload. It's been witnessed. Hey,